We'll guide you through how to record Roblox with OBS. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, make sure you've got OBS Studio installed. It's super easy, download it and install it, and you can then open it up. Then come over to the bottom left and select a scene. If there isn't already one, click on the plus button. Now you want to come over to the right and go and click on settings. You'll go and get the settings pop up and you want to go and click on output over to the left. Make sure the mode is set to simple and come down to recording. The recording path is where your video will be saved. And then you can choose the recording quality. So for me, I have high quality medium file size. I find this to be the most efficient option. Recording format, set that to MP4, it's the most compatible. Now when it comes to the encoder, because I've got an NVIDIA graphics card, I've got the NVENC option, otherwise you can just use the X264, that'll be fine. And they're the main settings. Now come over to the left into audio, and come into mic slash auxiliary audio, and go and choose your mic. Also you can go and enable desktop audio as well, just so you can record what's happening in Roblox and the rest of your computer as well. Then come over to the left into video, and you can now go and choose the resolution. So my monitor is a 2560p monitor, so that's why the base resolution is that. And then I scale it down to 1080p. Recording in 1080p will be fine, but you can always just have the base set to that as well. For example, like that, that'd be it's fine as well. Then you can go and choose the FPS. Ideally, I'd re recommend it being set to 60 as it makes it smoother, but 30 will also be fine. If you're experiencing lag, then you can go and change it to 30, but try starting with 60. And that's the same thing for the resolution. If you're experiencing lag, you could try changing it to 720p, but that's quite low for a sort of modern day video. I'd recommend 1080p. Now come over to the left into hotkeys and you can go and set a key to start and stop recording. So I personally use F10. And then once you've finished with your settings, click apply and you can press okay. Now come into sources like so, and go and click on the plus button in the bottom. And what you can do is you can either record your entire screen by clicking on display capture, press OK, and you can then choose the display and then go and press OK. It will be added and I'll just go and resize it by using the squares in the corner and we've now resized it. Or alternatively, you can just go and capture Roblox by using game capture or window capture. That's going to be up to you. I prefer just to capture my entire screen. And just before we start recording, come into the audio mixer and you may want to go and decrease desktop audio as otherwise that can sort of flood and drown out your own audio there. Now we're ready to start recording. So come into Roblox, find a game you want to play and go and launch it. Now here we are in Roblox and then what you can do is go out of Roblox into OBS and manually press start recording or you can go and press your hotkey. And now you're going to be recording and you can go and yeah, make your video. And once you've finished, you can then go and press F10 again and the recording will go and stop or whatever hotkey you set it to. Then you can go to where you set the video file path to and here's the video. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video.